To be a champion, I think you have to see the big picture. It's not about winning and losing, it's about everyday hard work and about thriving on a challenge. It's about embracing the pain that you'll experience at the end of a race and not being afraid. I think people think too hard and get afraid of a certain challenge. A champion is afraid of losing. Everyone else is afraid of winning. A true champion is a true champion. They go fight and win or lose, give it their all. Winning is great, sure, but if you are really going to do something in life, the secret is learning how to lose. Nobody goes undefeated all the time. If you can pick up after a crushing defeat, and go on to win again, you are going to be a champion someday. A champion is someone who gets up when he can't. Champions are treasures that are full of wisdom, encouragement, provision, love, guidance, and empathy. Champions are not the ones who always win races, champions are the ones who get out there and try. And try harder the next time. And even harder the next time champion is a state of mind. They are devoted. They compete to best themselves as much if not more than they compete to best others. Champions are not just athletes. If you think about it, there is absolutely no way possible to become a champion without having to gain victory through DR, I'll. To be a champion, compete, to be a great champion, compete with the best, but to be the greatest champion, compete with yourself. Everyone has the fire but the champions know when to ignite the spark. It's very easy to come up with an excuse for why things won't happen in life, but champions accept that there are many things they can't control, and instead, they master what they can. Champions know that success is inevitable, that there is no such thing as failure, only feedback. They know that the best way to forecast the future is to create it. I needed a champion oh, I became one, fulfill the requirements of your own requirements. If you're a champion, you have to have it in your heart. You learn to always reach for the best in life and not settle for less, to stand out from the crowd and not accept mediocrity. You'll become a champion. Champions are champions not because they do anything extraordinary but because they do the ordina, ride things better than anyone else. The true test of a champion is not whether he can triumph, but whether he can overcome obstacles. The average is only consumed with today, but the champion is obsessed with tomorrow before it arrives, therefore, he or she plans for it. A champion isn't made of muscle, a champion is made of heart. To be a champion you must act like one, act like a champion. A champion needs a motivation above and beyond winning. Grit, determination, the right amount of crazy, self-belief, everything it takes to be a champion. I have that.
Champions have different mentality they have a stronger self-belief. Never surrender until the challenge turns you into a champion. Fully commit to being a person of formidable intelligence and tenacity and a champion focused on every aspect of your own life. Vision gets the dream started dreaming employs your God, given imagination to reinforce the visi, on. Both are a part of something I believe is absolutely necessary to building the life of a champion, a winner. A person of high character who is consistently at the top of whatever game he or she is in. As we have seen, the importance of winning and losing can not be overstated, because a champion does not become a champion without experiencing both. Champions realize that defeat and learning from it even more than from winning is part of the path to mastery. In sports, you simply aren't considered a real champion until you have defended your title successfully. Winning it once can be a fluke, winning it twice proves you are the best. The difference between champions and everyone else is that champions are never afraid of losing, while everyone else is afraid of winning. Winning isn't everything, but wanting to win is. What does it take to be a champion? Desire, dedication, determination, concentration and the will to win. You can win all the tournaments you want, but the majors are what you're remembered for. It's how you're measured as a champion in our sport. The majors are where it's at. I've got a winner mentality, the mentality of a champion. I've grown most not from victories, but setbacks. If winning is God's reward, then losing is how he teaches us. Champions do not become champions when they win the event, but in the hours, weeks, months and years they spend preparing for it. The victorious performance itself is merely the demonstration of their championship character. I hated every minute of training. But I said, don't quit. Offer now and live the rest of your life as a champion. The last three or four reps is what makes the muscle grow. This area of pain divides the champion from someone else who is not a champion. That's what most people lack, having the guts to go on and just say they'll go through the pain no matter what happens. For me, I'm focused on what I want to do. I know what I need to do to be a champion, so I'm working on it. The vision of a champion is bent over, drenched in sweat. At the point of exhaustion, when nobody else is looking. Anyone can train to be a gladiator. What marks you out is having the mindset of a champion. A true champion is one who sweats from exhaustion when no one is watching. I don't count my sit, ups. I only start counting when it starts hurting. That is when I start counting, because then it really counts. That's what makes you a champion. A true champion wasn't born, but trained.
champions keep playing until they get it right. The real champions in life are so humble and gracious. They just continue doing what they do without all the posturing. I need to remain humble, stay disciplined and keep training. That's how I will continue to be a champion. Be a humble champion and create visible momentum for the value you deliver to the team. As a champion, you have the opportunity to see what God sees and your view of this race will become clear to you. you. Every champion was once a contender that refused to give up. When my body gets tired, my mind says this is where winners are made. When my mind gets tired, my heart says, this is where champions are made. Champions don't show up to get everything they want, they show up to give everything they have. The heart of a champion beats to a different drum. You become a champion by fighting one more round. When things are tough, you fight one more round. He has the heart of a champion he just refuses to lose. You have to believe in yourself when no one else does. That makes you a winner right there. The heart of a champion is not a light switch that goes on and off when someone's watching. It's like a sun that always burns. Believe you can and you're halfway there. Never stop, never give up, never stop giving yourself the self-confidence you need to be a champion. There's a difference in thinking you are a champion and knowing that you are. Carry yourself like a champion now so when you get there, it's not a surprise. I truly believe that it's all of the hard times that make you step up to the next level. And that's what makes you a champion. A true champion can adapt to anything. I am a member of a team, and I rely on the team. I defer to it and sacrifice for it, because the team, not the individual, is the ultimate champion. All pieces of the puzzle need to fall in the right place to be a champion team. We all have a responsibility to try and make this world better, whether it's through our work, the causes we champion, the way that we treat people, or the values we impart to the next generation. Once a champion, always a champion. I do Thai boxing Mondays, Jiu Jitsu Tuesdays and Thursdays, and Wednesdays I do boxing with Mark. He was a world champion at one point. I absolutely love it. I actually have a punching bag outside in my garden. I'm obsessed with working out I eat like a pig so it kind of makes up for that. For whatever it's worth, never fall a victim of a struggle. And when it so happens remain a soldier and a champion. You have to become a champion in getting quickly out of negative situations, because life will not spare you of them.
The only yardstick for success our society has is being a champion. No one remembers anything else. The champion uses the power of his pride to great advantage. Please don't call me arrogant, but I'm European champion and I think I'm a special one. No excuses play like a champion. There are 7 billion people in the world, but there's only one heavyweight champion of the world, and that's me. The world is starving for new ideas and great leaders who will champion those ideas. The best and fastest way to learn a sport is to watch and imitate a champion.